so welcome back we are talking about the today plot and uh, its application for knowing the stability of the system so whatever the uh, content that we have seen up till now that is about the stability of the system by using zeros and poles also by using ruth hartwitz criteria and uh, also we have seen how we can get it with the help of a bode plot so in the bode plot now uh, we have seen there are different uh, functions of a uh, or different uh, transfer functions are there out of that some parameters which need to be plotted in the form of graph so that is gain k integral and derivative factors of j omega first order factors and quadratic factors like that so after understanding the uh, these basic parameters or the frequently used transfer functions are there and their basic factors are there so these uh, factors and their body plot we have understood so now we will try to see how we can determine the required stability of the system or we can estimate the transfer function from the body plot so the first step in that estimation of transfer function from body plot is to know the order of the system so the final value of the phase speaks about the order so if the final value of the phase is minus 90 degree it means there is one extra pole compared to the zero because for every pole there is a minus 90 degree phase is there so if there are there is one pole and one zero so minus 90 for the pole and plus 90 for the zero so it will be final angle will be zero it means if the angle is 90 available over here minus 90 so definitely there is one more extra pole over there or only one pole is there and there is no zero like that second step is the number of poles and zeros so from the magnitude plot determine the shift in the slope so if the initial slope is minus 20 degree decibel per decade and final slope is minus 40 decibel per decade it means there are two poles and no zeros similarly now the third step is that uh, location of poles and zeros so if the poles or zeros are at origin they will pass 0 decibel at 1 radian per second if the poles and zeros are real determine the location it means the frequency at which the plot breaks away and the fourth step is about the gain so from the maximum gain determined from the magnitude plot subtract the gain of poles and zeros then equating this value to the formula 20 log to the base 10 of 10 k and determine the value of k so this will give us the value of k now let's consider one problem here in this case you can see uh, this is a magnitude plot this one is the magnitude plot and uh, this one is the phase plot so magnitude plot you can see here it is starting from this 2 and uh, it goes to minus 2 while the phase plot it starts from 0 and it goes to minus 90 and uh, accordingly the frequency is specified on the x axis so according to the first step you have to find out the order of the system in the first step so the final value of the phase is minus 90 degree it means there is one extra pole compared to the zero or could be two poles and one zero or maybe only one pole let us see now decide uh, the number of poles and zeros in the second step so you will find out that it is having only one pole now in the step 2 it was observed that ki uh, from magnitude plot determine the shift in the slope so in this case the shift in the slope you will observe that uh, there is only single slope is there so there is no shift in the slope it means there is only one pole now step 3 location of poles and zeros the pole is at 1 radian per second so if you observe the, uh, from the location of poles and zeros now the third step was 
to if the poles and zeros are at origin they will pass at 0 and 1 radian per second so you will find out here that the pole is at 1 radian per second here now step 4 about the gain so 20 log to the base 10 of 10 in bracket k is equal to 20 because this is nothing but the gain maximum gain 20 and uh, we have to subtract the gain of this is what we uh, are seeing that you have to subtract the gain of poles and zeros so if I subtract that uh, in this case now we will get the value of k that is equal to 10 means this is k is a constant so there is one pole that is s plus 1 and this is a constant k so it is transfer function of 10 for this particular body plot is 10 upon s plus 1 similarly we will see one more example now in this example you will find out here that uh, it is minus 40 to plus 80 range is there for the magnetic plot and minus 180 to minus 90 is the phase plot now this phase uh, is minus 90 here and it is going to towards minus 180 phase and uh, somewhere about uh, at around 68 decibel is the maximum value of the de value of decibel and this is a magnetic plot so first you have to decide the order of the system so you will find out that this is a second order system and the initial value of the phase is minus 90 degree and the final value of the phase is minus 1 degree thus there is one pole at origin and one on negative real axis so there are two poles uh, two poles so uh, location of so one is origin or pole at origin and another pole is at the real axis so location of poles now we have to decide so we will find out that there are two poles one pole is at origin and second pole is at 5 radian per second because the phase plot crosses 135 here degree at 5 radian per second so this radius uh, this uh, frequency is 5 radian per second corresponding to this 135 so there is one pole at this frequency and now about the gain so the magnitude plot starts at 60 decibel here and the pole at 5 radian per second contributes to 0 decibel till cutoff frequency of 5 radian per second and uh, pole at origin contributes 40 decibel so that will be equal to minus 20 decibel per decade multiplied by 2 decades on the this particular scale you can find here because this is 1 decade this is another decade so for 2 decade it is there therefore the magnitude of that is 40 decibel so contribution of gain is then 68 which was original maximum minus 40 which is due to the pole at the origin so remaining is 20 decibel now this 20 decibel will be equal to 20 log to the base 10 of 10 in bracket k and thus we will get the value of k that is 25 so the transfer function of this particular diagram is 25 upon s in bracket s by 5 plus 1 this is nothing but the transfer function for this particular type of body plot so here is the thing but uh, the two examples that we have seen from which we can get the transfer function of any system when the body plot is available so thank you thank you very much